All right, straight ahead, it's a light heavyweight matchup between John Jones and Forrest Griffin. Our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight tilt. Jones is one year his senior. He is one inch taller. He will have a seven inch reach advantage. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Light Heavyweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 16 wins, four losses. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada. Ladies and gentlemen, he is a member of the UFC Hall of Fame and the former UFC light heavyweight champion of the world, Carlos And now we're facing the opponent. This man is a look see do fighter, holding a professional record of 23 wins, one loss, and one no contest. He stands 64 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, ladies and gentlemen, he is the former UFC light heavyweight world champion. I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. Here we go. First round. You ready? You ready? Let's we are go. underway. All right, here's the Jackson Wink MMA product, former UFC champion John Jones. Huge, huge reach advantage tonight, as usual. We'll see if he can exploit it here in the early going. John Jones back in the octagon. Fans are going nuts. No surprise to see the This could be it right here. Oh, he might be out. Hard straight punch. Body kick, look at that. How about that shin? That one hurt. Oh! That shot blocked by Jones. Well, he gets cracked to the head there, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's almost moving into the strike at this point in time. You gotta get that head off the center line. John Jones with a stiff jab. Take down attempt there. Right hand is true, Joe. There he goes, side control. Nice. Working from the mounted crucifix. Excellent movement here on the ground. Back to side control. He's in half guard. Griffin gets up again, but he looks hurt, Joe. Oh, effective strike there by Jones. Good exchange there. Nice combination there. Really missing that right hand. He's doing a great job of mixing things up here, keeping it unpredictable. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. He's fainting with that punch. Showing like that it did stop a little bit. Combinations here. Lands a punch. Oh, tags 
him with the straight. Nice job there by Jones. Oh! Whoa! He is stumbling. Nice leg kick. Knee to the body. There's a single attempt. Now goes in and secures the takedown. So we cross the 30-second mark in our opening round. Change it to the southpaw stance now, Joe. Just out of range with that right hand. The horn sounds for the end of round one. So the horn sounds after that round. Big knockdown in that frame. Great round from Griffin. Yeah, that knockdown should have won him the round. It was a big moment in the fight. Let's take a look at that again. Let's see it one more time. Round two underway. That last round was absolutely insane. If this round gets off to anything like the last round, one of these guys is going out. I can't imagine a scenario where if they continue where they left off in the last round, that one of these guys doesn't get knocked out. Forrest Griffin was the winner of season one of The Ultimate Fighter, a man with tireless work ethic, a fantastic sense of humor, and one of the toughest guys to ever compete in the UFC. Well, the offense has been there. He has landed some good shots, but not really stringing them together and putting combinations on his opponent. He's got to mix up his strikes, change his tempo a little bit, and try to get his opponent out of there. Oh! Yes, he's, right hand. Hand. he's hanging on here, and he is in big, big trouble. Oh! What a leg kick! Oh, very nice. Oh, that's a good strike there by Johnny Bone. Low kick is there. Big he body shot. shot. Body. Jones gets double underhooks, Joe. There he goes, moves to his back. Controlling him, looks for the choke. He drops down for it. Now it's deeper. Wow. In full guard now. He lands a hammer fist. Just over two minutes now to go in round two. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Well, not ideal to spend this much time on the bottom, but you can't fault him for his activity. Landing strikes here from the bottom. Nice work by Griffin. John Jones finding the rage with his jab. That's a really strong left kick there by Griffin. How about that shin? Griffin gets caught by the inside leg. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Starting to do some really significant damage to the... Oh, another one! Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt bad. Oh, he's tagging him! Oh, we hurt him again. He hurt him. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. All right, that's the end of round number two. Oh, saved by the bell there. The round is over. He got knocked down just before you heard the horn. And, of course, he's only got 60 seconds with which to recover. Not a lot of time to get his head back into this one. Let's see that again. Let's take a look at it from a different angle. Here we go, 
Third round underway. Oh, strong punch there by Griffin. Nasty leg kick lands. Jones gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Oh, big right hook, but a whiff. Well, his opponent's got the read now, Joe, as he lands the punch to the head. He's got to change up his striking pattern and the tempo, or he's going to continue to be vulnerable to that count. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. All right, so another stiff jab there. Really good use of that weapon, not unlike he did in the previous round. Jones gets the takedown following that combination of strikes, mixing it up beautifully tonight. He's got it. Full mount. Well, he's been on his back here, but he's actually doing some pretty effective work. Joe lands a strike there from the bottom. Nicely done there by Griff. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Side control. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Under three minutes now to go in round three. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Oh, he is starting to put a lot more pressure on his opponent here, Joe. A lot lighter on his feet these last couple rounds of this fight. Oh. Man, he's in big, big trouble here. Oh, he might be out. He makes his way back to the stool, and he's only got 60 seconds to recover here, so we'll see if his corner, physically, mentally, can keep this fighter in the fight. And here's another devastating shot to the head that really does damage. And here's another shot to the head that really stuns. Incredible. Fourth round now, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Well, you've got to love this performance here tonight, Joe. He continues to land a high number of strikes, just as he did in the previous round, and seemingly not slowing down at all here tonight. Oh, nice punch there by Jones. The kick gets through. Connects with the punch there. How about that shin? Side leg kick by Jones. Effective punch there by Griffin. Oh! oh! He's in big, big trouble. Nasty knee to the body. Oh! Powerful jab. Oh! Griffin's worked in that arm. Nice job of pummeling, and he's got the double underhook snap. Trying to spin to the back. Back to the feet now. Oh! He's in big, big trouble here. He's hurt again. Oh! Oh! Big left. Oh, straight right. He hurt him with that hook. Big, big body, body 
shot. Nice shot there, too. Oh, he got caught. He's oh, out. He's out. He's out. Vicious uppercut. Lands on the button. Yeah, Joe, I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout. And that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So a big, big win for him here tonight. We can see it from another angle here. Here is the huge uppercut that lands right on the money and ends this fight. Here we see it again. Boom! Out cold. So a huge result and a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the big knockout win. That could hold up as one of the better KOs of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is going to stop for this contest at 2 minutes, 28 seconds of round number 4. Declaring the winner by knockout, John Bones! So Johnny Bones does it again. Congratulations to John Jones, to Mike Winkle, John, to the rest of the team. This is a big win here tonight. A lot of people wanted to see where John Jones was at at this stage of his career, and I think he proved here tonight. This is still a very prime John Jones, and on his best night, he's the best light heavyweight in the world, certainly proved as much here tonight. Congratulations to the UFC light heavyweight champion, John Bones Jones.